Good afternoon, Andrew. Thank you for coming to see us at the Cranfield Customer Management Forum today. Um, you talked a little bit about um, the trend towards mo the use of mobiles and tablets um, and the impact that's had on Dixon's retail. Can you tell us about that? Well, we've seen um, with the, the, the birth of the iPad and the, the uh, iPhone and similar devices uh, running other operating systems that um, the, the, the volume of usage is actually driving a behavioural shift in terms of how people access our website. So we're seeing um, a significant and ever-increasing volume of traffic and share of traffic that's coming through from mobile phones and from tablets. Um, and some of this is incremental to the traffic that we receive to desktop and PCs. But the traffic and behaviour is different. So um, what we're doing is monitoring how customers use those different devices and how they shop differently and then adapting our website accordingly to meet those different demands. That's really interesting. And the other thing that you mentioned is, is how you use the web analytics. So the, the, the data that you get from that. Um, tell me how you're using those. Well, we've, we've implemented a, a very thorough um, web analytics um, implementation um, that tracks not just uh, the visitors that are coming to the site and when they visit, but it tracks pretty much everything they do on the website, which pages they visit, um, how long they spend on each visit, which, which pages that they're less interested in. Um, we also look at which traffic sources people come from, so there is a definite distinct uh, behaviour um, difference between uh, traffic uh, visitors who come from uh, clicking on an email or uh, visitors who come from a social channel or visitors who perhaps come from um, paid advertising such as paid search where their decision about what product they want to buy is perhaps more made up and more, more decided than some of the other channels which perhaps lead more traffic, more customers um, uh, who are browsing and, and looking around. So we need to uh, adapt um, our analytics to ensure that we've got the right insight about the right customers at the particular point in their shopping journey, whether it's browse, research or purchase. Well, that's really interesting because you use that um, in store as well as online, don't you? Um, we do. We, because we, we're operating a, uh, an increasingly thorough multi-channel offering, um, the, whilst we're interested in customers who come um, to the website and immediately check out, um, increasingly we need to and, and perhaps um, have the product delivered to home uh, akin to a pure play um, model. We are operating um, other means, uh, other channels for customers to um, receive their products, so collect at store uh, where they can reserve a, a product that's already available in store and, and, and it can be there for them to come and collect. Um, or pay and collect where um, we can actually make sure a product from our, our entire range is delivered from our online warehouse to a store to the customer's convenience. Um, and having the analytics that understands those different channels, whether it's home delivery, pay and collect or reserve and collect, and understand the drivers of that different um, behaviour is crucial to making sure that we offer uh, the best experience for the customers as they move through those channels. Thank you so much. You're welcome.